Hello everyone, welcome back to another video with me, Luvan Plugnoot, the channel where we make things happen. I can't believe it's the first video for 2021 and it's end of January already. Been in a bit of a rut and thing is, action leads to more action. Just something I read in a book. If you haven't read this, it's, it's, an, it's a good read. It just gives you some perspective or open the mind to help you make that mindset shift that you need to make. Scrolling through Instagram, I found this image and I thought I'm going to recreate my own with something I have in the house. I came from my parents, they were on a vacation, they brought this back to me. So I was thinking a good African sunset in the studio. Let's do this. Okay, so this is all the stuff we need. Now we just need to start building the same. Okay, so I need to make sure that this seam here that you can't see. I'm not too worried about the edges, but this seam in the middle needs to be flushed. You, won't, you can't see it, otherwise it's not gonna sell the effect well. There's a little gap here, so I'm gonna make a mess but that's all part of the process I was afraid of you but I've been thinking I've been thinking otherwise it's true you were thinking I was afraid of you but I've been thinking otherwise otherwise it's true this is I think it will work it might work because I'm gonna use the 50 mil lens so I won't get the edges. I'm just maybe concerned at the back. It's gonna be the back. The sun is gonna be around here. I will be shooting from here, that direction. That will be the sun. And the next order of business would be to find a tree that looks like a acacia tree. It looks like this. So I'm gonna walk about in the garden and see if I can find one. So I can't really say I can't find anything in here. That will just be a silly excuse. I found a little gem. These were cut off, so, so I can use them. I'm done with this. This is, uh, this will be the sun, supposed to be the sun, which I connected to a dimmer switch. So I can actually change the intensity. And right over there we have the set so far. Which I think looks good. Let me show you. So here we have the set. The elephant, we have the tree. The sun will be in the background. Hopefully we can get some rays coming through here. But we'll need some fog for that and I don't have a hazer. So now it's a matter of setting up the lights to get it as I would like it. Because the background must be completely dark and I don't have a grid. So I'll have to make another plan. So let's start with the light setup. This is frustration. I didn't expect it to be, it's gonna be that difficult. There's a few things. Let me quickly jump in here, cause I never told you why the light bulb didn't work. Earlier in the video, I mentioned that it, the background should have been black. Now what I'm thinking about, it should not have been black. I should have played around with gradients and finding a solution and then putting that sun bulb maybe in the front or maybe a small gap at the back. Maybe even get some kind of a wallpaper that looks that has a gradient of a sunset 
and then use that. Here is a few test shots of the light bulb but it looks like it's dark and then there's a sun all of a sudden which doesn't make sense at all. So I didn't really think it through. Let's get back to the video. I just wanted to share that with you. Set designing was fine. Lighting is fine but for the life of me I could not fake a sunset. <laughs> I'm not sure how they do it. I actually went to YouTube and did some searching and I see a lot of people actually just uses a second screen. Put the huge screen on the back with the sunset picture on it and use that and just adjust the lighting so the scene connects well with the actual screen in the background. The screen I have is too small so I really couldn't do that. The only way I could do that is I put the screen right next or right at the end of the scene and still I had headroom that I couldn't fill. Can do that in Photoshop but the main challenge for me on this project was to do everything in camera which didn't happen. Here's a few test shots that I did. As you can see, not very good. Then I decided to switch it up to doing something like with the moonlight because I can get away with having a black background and only have a blue kind of hue from above that resembles the moon, which it also didn't turn out well. And then I ended off just getting a spray can and just doing the kind of a sunset type of vibe. Maybe the elephant stood in front of a big as mountain in the desert but there was rain so I played around with that and here's a few shots of that not bad the rain was a nice effect but that's it so some would say this was a fail but I'm of the opinion that there's no such thing as fail it's create learn repeat it's just a learning process and it gives you an excuse to try this again, which I will do. I'm gonna bring a TV from home and I'm gonna do that sunset one again. I just wanted to do the sunset one without a screen. I think that will be a challenge, but getting that gradient, uh, please, if you have any advice, please share. I would like to see how that goes. Anyways, thanks for hanging with me. Thanks for sticking around watching this BTS video. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a like. If you'd like to see more content like this, don't forget to subscribe. Go out, go make it happen. I'll see you next week.